what's going on guys and all that bullshit so i just had like an epiphany about some bullshit so first off let me say it and then i'm going to say why and then i'm going to say how i'm going to it's not the reason why but being petty and douchey is like just the cherry on top all right so i do remember like back in my space i found the other me there's someone with my same exact full name but um in italy but they do like sound engineering what's up bro you're probably never gonna watch this but uh uh we got into this conversation one time using it at the time what ended up becoming google translate uh and essentially what it was was uh he just had like i'm mean, like a music like his like a composer family and all that bullshit in italy and whatnot because like the ones who like I don't want to get to it. There's, there's actually there's a, actually some people with my last name in Australia who became like chef actors and shit like that. It's pretty trippy. They were on some thing called Family Food Fight or whatever the fuck it is. And anyways, uh, but uh, I was like, yeah, man, I, I like music too, but I just never really listened to it. And he was like, why? And I was like, well, honestly, at the time I was living in Seville, and I had I was like pretty much one step above being homeless we call it we call it couch surfing and i was like i just don't i mean like i don't have any money i don't i don't like like if i had a walkman i'd have to buy batteries then i have to buy the cd and all that bullshit which is again why allegedly pirating is the best but at the same time like uh, i won't get into it because like nothing's unique anymore People used to like make it and be like, just listen to my music. I don't give a fuck. And someone would be like, sign the record, sign the contract so that way you can get the bajillion dollars. Like, no, I don't give a fuck. I want my ass with your contracts. I want my ass with it. All right. We're the toddlers. We don't sell out. And then you have to like beg them. Like, no, please. The world needs to hear your voice. The world needs to hear your sound. I don't give a fuck. My sound is for the garage walls. It's not good enough yet. The toddlers aren't good enough for the world stage. I'll let you know when we're good enough. Like, please just sign the contract. Please take the money, please. Like, that's how it used to be. That's how, now it's like the reverse, right? I have to do some shit in a minute. Uh, anyways, um, uh, but now music is cheap and I can get it everywhere and I can listen to it. And I, all I do all day long is listen to music. And all that bullshit. And then, what was it? Uh, there, was some, um, there was another me that I met. I forgot what that one was about. I got bored one day and I just started looking up everyone who was named after me. Who was around my same age. And I was like, you're my long lost whatever the fuck. They're like, no way, dude, for real? We're actually very similar. We're pretty fucking similar. All of the me's are exactly like me. I don't know how else to say it. Like, you wouldn't think... That would be the case, but it's like actually like, it's like if I was a template and deployed across different, you know, like networks and then like, and then like the like, uh, nature versus nurture shit gets added on afterwards. Right. It's literally how, how it seemed like, but anyways, uh, what I'm going to... Oh, yeah, and then Angry Video Game Nerd. That's what it was. I'm not sure if Angry Video Game Nerd even remembers, but, like, a long-ass time ago... No, actually, no. It was maybe, like... Yeah, it was, like, 10 years ago or whatever on LinkedIn, of all the things. I was like, I used to watch you. And you had kept it ass. You guys were awesome. And no bullshit. Like, what it was was I saw them do all that shit with, like, make Captain S, and then since Captain S didn't get renewed for season two and all the bullshit was like because they were like as i understand it they start captain s started off as like a school project and then everyone wanted to get like super paid and so they just like canceled it anyways so i didn't know all that i thought that like they all like went to school and like studied super hard so they could make captain s right so i like studied so i started like i was like oh man if i want to like to do something successful with my life, like Captain S, I better like start studying and all that bullshit and take this shit seriously. Anyways, so then like later on, 
Angry Video Game Nerd did another video where he was like, actually, and I, I didn't ask him to or anything like that. I never really talked to him other than that time. But like, uh, 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 he was like, uh, yeah, and to think that I never used anything school-wise that I learned to do any of this shit. I just opened up Microsoft Paint one day and started playing with it. And I was like, huh. It's probably a good thing I didn't know that before because I would have probably, like, my life probably would have taken like a different turn. I would have been like one of those paint and douches begging for money and all that bullshit. Anyways, but now that I'm making pretty good money and all that bullshit and I, assuming that this other thing works out and all the other bullshit, I'll be like basically a millionaire again. I'm not just in principle. Uh, anyways, uh, what was I talking about? Yeah, so I'm going to get whatever... Uh, the equivalent of Microsoft Paint is for splicing together music. I am then going to do one of the, whatever the fuck I did to where my AI art thingies made SM shit a brick about ESPA. ESPA, yeah. And all that bullshit. Whatever combination I did, because I've been saving some, the whatever the fuck they were, allegedly. I've been saving some for a special occasion. Uh, but I'm going to allegedly do that. I'm going to use the AI art thingy. It's still only a beta right now, but I so it spits them out in like little chunks. But I'm going to splice of those together, and then I'm going to upload those to SoundCloud. And then I'm going to call myself a producer as well. And then I'm going to put in my bio on SoundCloud that I don't give a fuck about any of this. I will say, this shit does not matter. I am an adult. If you like this shit, I made this five minutes ago in passing. It's literally what I'm going to do. That's my opinion on all this douchey, bullshitty, producery bullshit. You're trying to impress a bunch of 12-year-olds who, to be quite honest, look, I love my niece to death and all that bullshit. She's going to be 11 soon, and uncle's trying really hard to get you everything by before your 11th birthday and all that bullshit. Count on him. As much as I love her, I honestly couldn't give a shit. I mean, like, within reason, what her opinion is, because she's a little girl. Like, I remember once, I should have played Candyland with her more. I should have, I, Amila, I should have, I should have played Candyland with you more. But it's just like, at the time, I'm pretty sure I was doing something in crypto or, or like, studying for something. And I was just like, I don't, as, as I'm, I'm sure that, like, Shoots and ladders and all that bullshit is fascinating right now, but like I have some shit to do that I gotta take care of. Like, but like I played anyways, but like I should have played more is what I was saying. Anyway, so like what I'm saying is like I honestly couldn't give a fuck one way or the other if something I did impressed a child because I'm an adult. And like when I was a kid, things that impressed me were like Legends of the Hidden Temple and like a video game and shit like that. So it's not really like anything too fancy. Like I impressed some 12 year olds. Like I got some views. Okay. Ever hear that, that bullshit? It's like that and a, well, I was going to say that in a quarter, but now it's like that in like $17 will get you a cup of coffee. Right. Especially in New York. Right. Anyways. Uh, but like, no, seriously, I'm going to make, a whole bunch of crazy ass AI shit. I'm even gonna find what was it? Stealth was telling me, or assuming Stealth is Nick. What's up, bro? Because Nick's got some pretty good mix shit, and I think he was telling me how he uses like scripts of some kind to like do all the work for him. So I'm sure there could be an AI component to doing that mixing bullshit as well, and I can release it all for free and shit in everyone's face at the same time. That's one more thing I can put down on my thing that I've also done while still holding a job and not begging for anyone's money because you all are fucking losers.